One of the area's most successful pet rescues needs help. Lucky Puppy Rescue in Holmes County has stopped accepting animals due to funding. As News 13's Courtney Fegley tells us the number of strays in our area has become overwhelming and Lucky Puppy needs money to take care of them. For 16 years, Lucky Puppy Rescue has been giving dogs that were cast aside a second chance at life. But the nonprofit is now in dire financial condition and needs help to carry on its work. The main issue we're having right now is financial. Um, we have probably less than a month's worth of operating income in the bank at the moment. And we're carrying a little bit of credit card debt with uh, food and vet, vet bills. The problem is the overall economy. Donations have dropped off and inflation has increased operating costs. We can't afford the number of staff that we need. Uh, we used to get all of our food donated, but lately we're having to buy uh, probably 80% of our food. Um, and so that's been a, a pretty big drain on the budget. Uh, price of fuel doesn't help. You know, our success comes from moving them north for adoption. Over 200 dogs currently live on the farm waiting to be adopted. The longer they stay here, the more expensive it is to take care of them. Many of the lucky puppy animals go to Matson's Argyle, New York location, where she's had great success finding them homes. Tight budgets have forced her to close the doors to new dogs here locally and postpone expansion in Argyle. Without injection of cash, she may be forced to close down permanently. That would be huge to our success is if we could find some financial support to complete that expansion and then the dogs would have a shorter time here, which would cost less money, and they would get adopted faster. In Washington County, Courtney Fegley, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Lucky Puppy Rescue could use cash, pet food, supplies, as well as volunteers. If you'd like to help out, you can find a link to Lucky Puppy Rescue on our website, mypanhandle.com.